Hi there, this is Chroma from the Plate.gg community and today I will show you how you can use Plate.gg to make your Minecraft server public hosted on Google Colab. First thing we need to do is open up Google Colab. I want to point out the Google Colab, it is not made to uh, run Minecraft servers but it is made to run Python. We will use Python to uh, run a Minecraft server on the Google servers. Click upload here and upload the file linked in the description. This is a script I made. It's uh, um, inspiration. Uh, it's inspired, for, sorry, from Minecraft, which is a less optimized script. This is a way more optimized uh, uh, spreadsheet. It is not a spreadsheet, sorry. Um, it is a way more optimized code. It uses the latest version of Plate. It is overall better. Here are the steps for the setup, setup and uh, here are the steps for to run the Minecraft servers. It's really easy. Uh, every step will be covered in this video and uh, this video will be linked down here when it will be uploaded. First thing we need to do is run install Java, which will install Java on our environment. It's gonna ask us about uh, to connect our Google Drive, which is required because there we go. It's required because uh, our Minecraft server will be run from Google Drive. Every folder, every single file about the server is, is, is gonna be stored on our Google Drive. Um, obviously, if you need to upload your custom um, server, like a uh, modded server, etc., you can do it. I'm gonna show you how you can do it. There we go. JDK 17 is installed and working. Second thing we need to do is set up a Minecraft server. As you can see, this, code's only, this code only uses PaperMC, but of course, if you have a Minecraft modded server, you can first create it and set up on your PC, then upload it on Google servers and uh, on Google Drive, sorry, and run it from here. So it's gonna ask us about uh, Minecraft Desiderate Minecraft version. I'm gonna select 1.20.2. Then get the link for the server jar, and if we go to our Google Drive, right here, there is our Minecraft server folder, which contains server.jar and illa.txt, which has is a txt file that accepts illa automatically using this type with these two lines of code. The server.jar has been downloaded from this script. We need then to set up plate.gg. Just run this code. There we go. It's gonna give us the plate.gg claim code. Just visit this link. If you have already an account, just log in. I don't have an account, so I'm gonna create a guest account. Now here, the program has already been accepted in my account, this is going to check forever. It is normal because if we go back to Google, to Google Colab, we can see plate setup has been written to the plate.toml configuration file and the code has been run. That's because if I go here then log in, we can see our agent right here. Uh, no tunnels, of course, but uh, that's because the agent has already been accepted by us visiting the claim code. Now we need to run our Minecraft server. There we go, it's working. And if we refresh this page a couple of times, we might end up seeing that our agent will connect indeed. This should be working. There we go. We have our agent connected and our server is starting. If we go back to Google Drive, we can see more folders have appeared, more files are appearing. That's because our server is being created and being hosted on Google servers. There we go, preparing world. Meanwhile, this does its thing, so I'm going to open up Minecraft.
enter the game. Alright, as you can see there is the console here, you can type something like op your name, there we go, timer set, and here we have our agent connected, I'm gonna create a tunnel for Minecraft Java, meanwhile Minecraft has opened, I'm gonna click direct connect, and this is our link, this is the address and this is the IPv4, I'm gonna use the IPv4. And as we can see right here, Chroma 4 has, uh, has joined the server, and there we go. And we can play Minecraft on a server hosted on Google Colab and being published by Play.gg. Thank you for watching, I hope this was helpful. Anything related to this code is right here, this is my Discord username, you can contact me here. This is the play.gg Discord server and there is the play.gg website. There we go. As you can see I'm in the server, it's hard, it's taking a while to load that because I, I don't have that much of a great computer, I have shaders on for some reasons. But I'm in the server, as you can see I logged in and out. And that's it. I hope this was helpful and have a good one.